Hey guys, I know I look like shit right now, but I'm about to get ready for a bowl, so it's about to change. I'm going to go to the Pink Hope Cancer Charity Bowl tonight, and so I want to look really glamorous. Starting with my Tarte Clean Slate Primer. Now I'm going to use my Luminous Silk Foundation from Giorgio Armani. Sorry, this room is a right mess right now. But I just got back from overseas, guys. I can't tell you, like, how difficult it is for me to film when I have jet lag. Putting this on first over the pimple so I don't have to deal with it anymore. Oh, man. Oh, this foundation is so beautiful. Dip brow pomade. I'm using it on a liner brush so it comes out a bit more natural. It looks a bit more natural because I'm not using a... Uh, angle brush so not as much comes off. EX1 Invisiwear Concealer on a brush like this, one of these brushes. What do you call these brushes? Flat brushes? Oh my god, I'm trying so hard not to fall asleep. How am I going to make it through this bowl? Tap a bit on that booby while we're at it. Load her up. Burberry Eye Colour Stick as a base. Don't apply too much of this. What is that? Ah, you're not invited. Oh, now my eyes are closed. <laughs> Gonna have a really sexy, sleepy eye look today. Bedroom eyes, literally. Now, don't hate me, but these Inglot palettes, I made them when I was in England. I bought them from Inglot. And, um, if you want me to find out what's on the back of these dang palettes, it's really hard to get them out, and I actually broke a pan when I was trying to see what the colour was of one of them, so I'm really sorry, but... I'm sorry. Okay, so I'm going to start out with a shimmery champagne colour on the centre of my lid. Oh, yeah. Oh, Damn! Did you see that? That woke me up. I'm gonna take this mauve. I think I say colors wrong because one time I called something lilac and everyone was like, that's mauve! Mauve! However you say it. Putting the mauve, mauve, through the socket. This is a little brush that everyone should have. It's called the blending E36 from the Performance Eye Kit from Sigma. It's so good. Just slots right into the socket. There's only a couple times in life when you're going to want something small in your crease. This is one of them. That's Pritz. That's Pritz. Yeah. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling, I'm feeling, I'm feeling myself. <laughs> Australians sound so dumb when they try to rap, except like Hilltop Hoods obviously sound cool, but otherwise when you try to rap like an American singer or like Beyonce, it just sounds so bad. Something like this or something like this, which is just a slightly larger brush. And then just, just go toward the outside of your eye. Oh yeah, mm-hmm, yeah daddy right there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, what do you call that, Kel? That's great. Just keep blending. It's just getting, like, too high. So, we're going to have to do something about that. And what we're going to have to do, I don't know what's wrong with me right now, is take this on this and do this. Okay. Take that dark color again in there. Let's get to the bottom of it. My eye. They're not even, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> Close the palettes. And that's like the best part of this whole thing because these palettes actually why are you closing this thing you need it let's take this shimmery thing 
and put it in there. Oh yeah. And then while you're here, take this and put it here. Eyeliner, Makeup Forever Artist Liner, the black one. Mascara. Now I have basically no lashes right now, but I'm going to still stroke their ego by bothering to put this also very expensive mascara on them. I went and bought stuff that makes your lashes grow, so I'm going to start putting that on it and then I'll be able to go back to Amy Jean and she'll fix them and make them look pretty again. But right now they look oh, really bad. Lashes. These are House of Lashes, House of Lashes Siren Lashes with Duo Glue. Lower, release. Under my eyes, I'm going to use the L'Oreal True Match Concealer and just some dots in there. Oh yeah. Um, maybe let's just put some there. And here. And here. And let's just completely contour our face. taking my Master Precise Liner from Maybelline over the lash line I'm gonna set my under eye area I know, who am I? this is not a typical Chloe move but the people want the glam then for the rest of my face I'm gonna use my very beloved NARS Luminous Powder this stuff is like, I'm gonna like tilt my head. Blink Eyebrow Mousse. Now, I've never used this before, but this is a beautiful looking product. It's the Laura Mercier Ritual Powder, and it's just a bronzer, but it's baked. I'm going to use my powder brush to make sure that's nice and soft. Wow, I love that. And I'm going to highlight Dior Skin Nude Air. I almost don't want to use it because of the printing it has. Yes! <sighs> Dang, that turned out better than expected. I don't know why. I've used this before. I don't know why I didn't remember how good it was. Oh yeah, come up there. Yes. Surat Beauty Blushes. I'm going to use this really bright one. Don't be scared. Just a small amount. This will last a lifetime, this blush. Then I'm taking Plum Lip Liner. Then this is the Ariana... Sorry, I just kind of just tested it first. This is the Ariana Grande Viva Glam Lipstick. So the makeup is finished, but now I'm going to go do my hair and put my dress on.